Stop begging for people attention. What we look like begging for people attention. You can't be you can't be on no dirt with a person because they don't like you. They got they got types too. They got opinions too. You gotta abide by them. Even though it might hurt sometimes. Cause I, I ain't gonna lie, it hurt. You be like, damn, why don't you want me? But at the end of the day, you still gotta live your life. Yo, what's going on, YouTube, man? Welcome back to another video. You already know who it is. It's your boy Leroy, man. I appreciate y'all tuning in to the kid again. You feel what I'm saying? But today, we finna start off by doing something different. You know what I'm saying? I hope y'all enjoy this. I'm finna put y'all down on some game. Okay, so the topic of today is, as y'all can see by the title, stop begging for people attention. Don't do that. We don't do that around here, man. What we look like begging for people attention. And this goes for everybody. This goes for people that's in relationships. This goes for people that's looking for friendships. That's looking for to, to get in relationships. This goes for everything. Everything under the sun, man. First off, we're going to talk about when people are ignoring you. And that goes for everybody. If they ignore you, that's a sign. Just chop it up. Chop it up and move on to the next person. I don't know if that's real harsh. You know what I'm saying? It's harsh. To say, but you just gotta move home, bro. Whether you waiting for a text back, if you waiting to hang out, all that. If they stalling to do all them, all them steps, they not really trying to see you for real. They not really trying to hang out with you for real. Cause if they was, if they was willing to hang out with you and kick it with you, and chop it up with you, best believe they'll be right next to their phone, waiting for you to call. They heart, this might sound corny, heart skipping a beat, waiting for your call, you know what I'm saying? But if they not doing that, if they waiting for hours to text back, or if they just circling around or avoiding the question, or they be like, wait, wait, what was you saying? What was you saying? They not trying to link for real. Like I said, just move on, bro. Move on. Do your thing. Continue what you're doing. Continue reaching out to different people, man. Find you a new girl, find you a new boy if you're a girl to um, kick it with. It's plenty, it's plenty fish in the sea, it's plenty good looking females, it's pretty good, you know what I'm saying? Handsome dudes out there where y'all gonna find somebody somehow, you know what I'm saying? It's just up to you to go find them. Cause that, that's, that's really what it be for real, for real. We, I feel like as people were lazy to find that person that matches our energy, you know what I'm saying? And there is somebody out here for us. I, I truly believe that there's somebody out there for everybody. But sometimes we get stuck on how good a person look or how how they carry themselves. But sometimes we got to think more about what they look like. We got to think about their personality. We got to think about... Um, they cleanliness, is they hygiene even good? Sometimes girls be looking fussy and be musty or they breath kick. You know what I'm saying? So it, it, it's, it all relies on getting to know a person. And if the person is not willing to th think about you or find you well enough to kick it with, then maybe, maybe it wasn't in the cards for you. Maybe God was like, you know what? I, I could find somebody better. I could find somebody better for you. Just keep on looking. Just keep on looking. Because the more you talk to a person, the more different their personality is from the other person. You be like, oh, I like this and that person. But then you turn around and you like that and another person. So you just got to really pick. pick. You got to pick and make up your mind. And trust me, I know. Trust me. Oh, it's, it's plenty of times I'd be like, man, this girl look good, man. This girl look bomb, man. But sometimes when I talk to them, they don't be on shit at all. I ain't gonna lie. They, they, sometimes they not what I'm looking for. And it's okay. Because not everybody's meant for everybody. I mean, you, you gotta know what you want. Personally, you gotta know what you want in a female or in a male. You gotta know. Because if you don't know, you just out here just... Fishing, just randomly fishing. You know what I'm saying? But when you kind of got your idea, now you have a checklist in your head. You're like, oh, I like this, boom. 
Okay, she got that, she don't got that, she don't got that. And sometimes it'd be major deal breakers. They they might look bad, but you'd be like, ah, I can't mess with you. Now you go to the other one. But shit, they might be crazy on the low. You never know. They might be stalkers. They might be obsessive. But God seen it and was like, yeah, we don't want that for you. I don't like that for you. You too good of a person to have that. Or they could be toxic. You, you you really never know when it comes to people. You know what I'm saying? But the most important thing that's in this video that you have to take into consideration and add it to your lifestyle is always be yourself. There's a lot of things that come down to that, man. Always be yourself. Don't try to be somebody that you're not just to impress that girl, just to, just to impress that guy. Like I said, it's somebody out there that's looking for your personality. It's somebody out there that would love to be with you. And shoot, you, you never know. They probably look better than the person you think that's bad. As soon as you try to be somebody that you're not, and then you act like the person that you really are, they might not even rock with you. You feel me? So that shit is overly dead. So don't even try. Because what, what's the point of acting like somebody you're not, and then to a certain point, then you acting like somebody that you are for real and they see that and then now they be like oh I don't even mess with you no more now nobody messing with you how that look you feel what I'm saying so don't don't try to go out your way to impress a person just do what you gotta do enjoy what you enjoy and they gonna pick up on that they gonna be like who that or they gonna be interested I'm telling you they gonna be interested in you they gonna be like man I wanna be with him scratch bump that other dude I want to be with you, or or that one homie. He be like, oh, I I like I like him. He different. I want to kick with bro. Or maybe you got good head on your shoulders, and they be like, man, you know what? He actually raw. Like, I fuck with dude. You feel what I'm saying? So, and don't worry about getting rejected, man, cause that's what comes with the game. That's what comes with reaching out to people, trying to find new friends. Uh new relationships, everybody's going to get rejected. Don't get in your feelings about it. Don't get butt hurt. Don't get the wig in on the girl because she don't want you. Like, that's why I don't want you no way. Nigga, you text her because you wanted her, bro. You know what I'm saying? So you can't be you can't be on no dirt with a person because they don't like you. They got they got types, too. They got opinions, too. And they you got to abide by them. Even though it might hurt sometimes. Because I, I ain't gonna lie, it hurt. You be like, damn, why don't you want me? But at the end of the day, you still gotta live your life. I think my phone ringing, but but we, we, we ain't thinking about that. I'm trying to put y'all on game real quick. And always remember, man, always remember, anything forced is not good. I'm gonna say that again. Anything forced is not good. And it's definitely not worth it in the long run. Because if you had to force somebody, if you if you had to beg and force somebody to be cool with you, they not really cool. It's not genuine. When things come naturally and when things come off the kindness of their heart, it's a way better reward than you begging for somebody. And you going out sad. All these people out here in the world and you begging for that one person. It, and for you men out there, for you niggas out there, men, you know how many girls is on the planet? We're outpopulated by girls, bro. So, what is you sitting here tripping for her for? Man, you better lock in, bro. You better lock in. And if you don't want nobody else, if you don't want no other girl, man, get on your grind. Get on your grind. Stack that bread up. And then that girl gonna come back. Watch. And speaking about things coming back, if it's really meant for you, they gon' they gonna come back around. They gonna come back around. Eventually they're gonna come back around. Trust me, bro. So don't even don't even get in your feelings, man. Things happen. And things happen for a reason too. God God only knows it. And if you believe in God, if you don't, I believe in God. So I'm gonna say God always has a purpose. God gonna get you through throughout anything man you can do it you feel me but yeah 
With that being said, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'm going to do a lot more sit-downs like this with y'all because I feel like I feel like I can help y'all through some things. You, you know what I'm saying? Because I be going some things in my head too. But why not rent to y'all and try to figure things out with y'all? Because I know a lot of people be going through what I go through. I'm only 21, man. You feel me? So it's a lot. It's a lot of things I gotta learn. But I know a lot at the same time because I be talking to my peoples. I be talking to my parents and stuff, and they be chopping it up with me. So yeah, consider me your big brother now. Yeah, or your little bruh. Nah, never that. Never little bruh. Big bruh. Yeah. Yeah, nigga, we going though. It's your boy Leroy. Any out. Peace. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all and everything that y'all do for me. All right, y'all. Wow.